Good morning. How's everybody doing today? Uh, it's been a long morning already, so it's a good thing. Been busy. Uh, hope everybody's having a good Friday morning and getting ready for the weekend. Just a quick tip here, okay? It's very simple, very quick tip here. This goes to all buyers because I've seen people buying their fifth, tenth home. I've seen them where people buying their first home. Always, always get your home insurance early on in the process. Get that set up early on in the process because what can happen is that you get to closing and then all of a sudden, uh, it's you know people are scrambling around trying, trying to get the quote, trying to get the insurance from the insurance company. They're not calling back or they're calling back and, and you know people are on the phone and all of a sudden it's a scramble. Get it done within the first seven to 10 days of the process. So once you sign all your disclosures, Get your insurance in place. If you have any questions on that, yes, you know that, that's something that, that we can take a look at for you. Uh, we can't do it for you. We can't, you know, persuade you to go here or there. But try to get that in place within seven to ten days. Because what happens is that uh, you know at the end everything is flying around. We get the title work. We've got the appraisal. We got the uh, you know clear to close. And all of a sudden, people are standing around waiting on the insurance. So kind of what we do on the front end is say, hey, listen, do this, 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 and this, and this. Uh, right away and so forth. But I've seen it a lot of times where, where people don't get it up front or they drag their feet. You don't have to pay for it until closing, but it's good to get that in place now early on in the process. Simple thing, but I see it a lot. I see a lot of people drag their feet on it, but get your home insurance in place and check out some different quotes, you know, as far as the insurance. You know, try to get a $500 deductible or a thousand, see what the prices are, include your cars in that. Once again, I don't sell any of that stuff. But just some quick tips here to try to help you out with that, okay? Let me know if you got any questions on that. Uh, if you do, just comment down below. Shoot me a private message or a quick text. Have a great, great Friday. If you need anything, just let me know. Bye-bye.